Paul writes, For there is one body and one spirit, just as you have been called to one glorious hope for the future. There is one Lord, one faith, one baptism, and one God and Father who is over all, in all, and living through all. So what, what's the illusion there? It's, he's pointing to oneness, right? This is really important for us, oneness. If there's ever a time in the body where we've got to recognize and esteem and champion oneness, it's now. So much division in the church. So much. It's ridiculous. We're going to believe different things. Yeah, fine. But who unites us is more important than what divides us. And so we're all one in him. And our oneness comes from being in Christ. 